That was him. Oh my god, I think we drilled him. I've always loved hunting for the wolves, but I just don't necessarily love hunting them on the Yukon Valley. For me, I feel like they'd be way more fit in a place like this, where we're out here on Medve Taiga, and you have just this huge winter tundra land, and the wolves could just roam from one spot all the way across the whole entire map, where you have huge wide open lakes, you have really vast forests, and then you have nice open valleys as well. But there's always snow here, and for me, something about snow and wolves just really, really makes me excited. We got the 300 Magnum here. <laughs> we don't have a scope, and <laughs> we also don't have <laughs> any bullets. <laughs> Which uh, is going to make for a pretty difficult attempt at trying to get down this brown bear. I mean, this is kind of what I'm talking about here. We got a whole pack of wolves out here, but I mean, look at the surroundings. We're out here in like a desert fall slash, I don't even know. I feel like we're in kind of Arizona mixed with Ontario all in one here, but it's just like you have this versus a huge wide open winter tundra with vast forests and, you know, really cool valleys and stuff like that. And just to be able to see a wolf, like silhouetting it in the snow, it's just awesome. It really is. I was hoping to find a nice male here, but I mean, you know what? We're going to take down what we can get. So that one's kind of facing at us. Smoke that. Oh, there's a nice seven. There we go, and a six as well. Where are they heading to? Oh, looks like they're turning back around. There's a six. There's a female. There's another six. I mean... It's pretty open if he would come this direction. There we go. There he is. About 350 out. I'd say we smoked him. And I might be right. I mean, what else could we have hit? I guess it could have been intestine. But 500 yards. Now that was like three. Well, oh, it was 350. Well, it might have been intestine. No, it shouldn't have been intestine. Because I held high that time and we didn't hit high. I mean, we hit high, but we hit like really high. I was thinking we'd get some... Some drop to our shot. So yeah, that should be another good hit, right? I think so. I think what it is, is it's just our shots are so far that... Ooh, that dropped low. That definitely dropped low. But our shots are so far that by the time it's getting there, we're just barely getting enough penetration to get a single lung. So that's kind of what's happening here. All right, we got a couple of wolves down over here. I believe they're both female. But. Oh. We got another wolf running through here. Where'd it go? Oh my god! He's hit, but not good enough. Holy. Oh my God. There's a whole pack of wolves here. Oh my God. Reload, reload, reload. 
Well, I'm not exactly sure where they went, but uh, wow. That's the first shot we took. Left long shoulder shot at 315. Second one at 327, got an intestine stomach shot. And we hit this thing with the Glock probably like four or five times here. Did in fact eventually get a non-vital hit, but where did it run off to? Ooh, it was a nice one too. It was a nice one. Pretty sure it ran back this way. It had to have gone this way. Because I would have seen him go the other way. All right, we got blood here. That's old blood. Well, ran into some more blood over here. And we got our wolf down right here. It's probably either a six or a seven. Okay, good. It was a six. First shot, drop low. Second shot, got stomach. Third shot, got intestine. All with the 10 millimeter. Anyways, can you imagine how awesome it's going to be to be able to come out here on Medved Taiga and just find a huge pack of gray wolves roaming around the ice or just like going through these valleys like this going across the hills howling out here i don't know it's gonna be pretty awesome and i know for sure we're gonna be getting great wolves added to medved taiga very soon man i knew we forgot something we kicked up a bunch of wild boar and i forgot to bring my glock all right they're probably gonna go down right here yeah they are oh my god they're going down this giant cliff right in front Wait, are they coming back up? See, if they go down, we'll be setting pretty good. Oh my god, they're going down! Whoa, 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 whoa. There they go! Smoked! Perfect shot. What a smoke, but shot high. It's so hard. Oh, I'm empty. To aim with this thing without the sight. Holy. I mean, seriously, talk about a perfect time to have our 10 millimeter right now. Look at all these hogs down here. All right, now we're hitting them. Now we're hitting them. Whoa. Oh, we just stacked up three of them. Come on, reload, reload, reload. Get him before he goes up the hill. Oh, smoked him. Boy, I really wish we had a red dot. I mean, if we had a red dot right now, we would be just stacking them up, to be honest. Because it's so hard to be able to get on them with this... With this sight, because the thing is, it shoots... It shoots a little bit right, so you have to hold left on them. I mean, we're getting some. Don't get me wrong, we're definitely getting some, but... Like, that thing would be smoked right there. Got it. Is that all of them? I mean, there has to be more that took off. We just weren't able to get them. All right, well, we definitely got quite a few down. So let's go over here and pick them up and see how we did. I'm seeing one, two, three, four of them down right here. Uh, one is actually standing up still, so... We should finish that one off right away. Oh, look at that, a running heart shot, 47 yards out. That's pretty cool, and it was actually a boar as well. Very nice, straight to the heart. Then we got... A sow and another sow double lung shot and another sow double lung shot double lung shoulder blade on the run got some more bud down here and we got two more wild boar stacked up right over here that's gonna be a dark brown female and a dark brown female double lung liver shot 
So yeah, there definitely should be a couple more because I'm pretty sure there was at least like eight boar in this herd. And we only took down about five of them. Maybe six. We're getting a call from a boar. Oh, a bear, 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 150 yards out. I can't pull out the 300 Magnum in time. So we're going to be going for a shot with the AR-308. And hopefully we connected. Yes, we did. And there goes a the boar. There goes a the boar. Right over the top of him. Definitely not going over him that time, though. And the same thing with that shot. He is absolutely smoked. Let's pick up this bear. It's going to be a gold, so we can definitely use it. It's a cinnamon, 24.53. Pulled off a perfect right lung shot at 140 yards out. Decent penetration with the 308. But yeah, you can definitely use it. Now let's go over here and try and find this boar. All right, we just got a call from another brown bear male down over in this thick woods here. This time we have the 10 millimeter Glock in case we need it. We also have the AR-308 and we have the 300 wind mag. So we're setting pretty good, let's just say. All right, he called down here somewhere. But I am not seeing any huge brown bear running. And there it is. Oh, it's a five medium. Not bad. All right, shot looked absolutely perfect. It was. But we want to try and slow him down a little bit more. All right, he's down. So I believe slot six is the 300 Magnum. Yes, it is. I got to try and remember that next time we see something big like that. We'll bust out the 300 Magnum instead of the AR-308. Not that the AR-308 isn't capable of doing it. It's just, um, you know, I'd rather have a little more knockdown power. All right. So I actually thought our bear went down. It definitely went down to 0%. But apparently it kept on running even though it went down to 0%. Okay, but it is down, however, right over here, and it looks like it led us to another bear. Yeah, we got some more bear tracks right in front of us here. Left lung shot, perfect running shot there, and it was a male, but that is going to be a female bear track. But then there's another bear track here, and oh my god, that's a nice track. Now that is something that we need to find. It should be somewhere around like an 8 mythical. Or potentially even bigger. I don't know. It's been a while since I've seen a decent bear. Ooh, there it is. A beautiful level 7. About 100 yards out, but we are not going to get a shot off. Because we want to make a nice perfect shot. Cow moose there. Well, definitely not getting him in that shot. That's for sure. <gasps> that was him. Oh my god, I think we drilled him. He's for surely hit. I hit him a little far back. But that is not bad. Where'd he go? Did I shoot him again? Well, <laughs> just smoked that one. It wasn't exactly the boar. Wait, did we get both of them? Oh my god, we did! Yep, that's definitely our bear. However, I am not seeing a bunch of blood up here. But I'm not seeing any blood either. Oh my god, no way! Look at this! Dude! Oh, that right there is vital hit. And that right there is where our bear ended up. We're getting a call from another male lynx. And that actually could potentially be... A giant, so we're gonna have to check that out. But this is kind of awesome. Look at how this bear went down. I mean, like, if you ever wanted to take a trophy shot of a bear, you honestly wouldn't even have to do it because it's already in the perfect position right there. Look at that. Yep, just like that right there. Doesn't get much better than that. All right, let's pick him up. Oh my god, we did pull off the shot. 
Got him on the run at 160 yards and made a running left lung shoulder blade shot. 25.97 gold. Gray. Brown bear down right there. That is pretty awesome. And it's definitely our biggest gray brown bear that we've ever gotten. So that's sweet. That's really, really sweet. Holy, but that is, oh my God, a giant eight mythical. And somehow I lost it. But there's actually a nice wide open valley down here where we could get some nice shots off if we need to. I just want to make sure we find the mythical. There he is! Wait, which one is he? Is there two mythicals? There must be. Uh, I'm pretty sure we dropped him. Yes, we did. We got him. Took a directly quartering away shot at about 150 yards. And I think we hit everything. I didn't even see him run, to be honest. But I also think there might be two mythicals. All right, so he should be right about here somewhere. Oh, definitely some good blood. Really good blood. And he's down right there. So we didn't drop him, but we definitely smoked him. Well, let's take a look at this beautiful mythical 37.69 and we honestly hit every single possible thing that we could have hit you're talking intestine stomach liver right lung and flesh 137 yard quartering away shot absolutely perfect shot and a gray gray wolf down not only that it is a massive mythical now imagine how cool that thing's gonna look on the snow coming in Whew. all right guys well that's gonna be it for this video hope you guys enjoyed it thank you so much for watching and let me know are you excited about having the gray wolf edition to medved taiga because i sure am but that's gonna be it thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next time